I begin above the bridge with a heavy float and a small hook, hoping to boss the current and find a line with a fissure line. A trickle of maggots, constant tweaks and adjustments. I feel clumsy and rusty, spluttering like an old car on a cold morning. But gradually, I find a rhythm. Dace flash across the gravel, darts of lightning, fish built for the fast, shallow water. Sharp and sleek and silver, bites so fast I miss more than I hit. And these are not two inch tiddlers that a kingfisher might make dinner of, but wily and wiry half pounders that fight like fish several times as large. It's late November, the greens have gone to brown, a grey sky and oily drift. The River Test in Hampshire, probably the most iconic chalk stream of all. Scrub and floodplain, reeds, rush and sedge. This is a natural paradise, but the landscape is anything but natural. John is part of this river, keeping is not a job but a lifestyle. Tending the stews, clearing the sluices, regulating the current. His day does not have a beginning or end, but is a complete immersion. For generations, keepers have minded the test clean, clear water, purified through chalk, a captivating life source that benefits from the hand of man. Upstream, I find slow, steady water and depth. This is the perfect place to find roach. A shimmer of cold blue, a blood orange eye, pristine glisten in the luring light. And I'm greedy, I want one bigger. Red top dips. A familiar thump from eight feet down. John walks to find me and hopefully guide me. He is the heartbeat of this river, breathing with it and understanding deeper than knowledge.
the river responds. The valley here is wide and wild, an unkempt sanctuary, sung to in spring by a thousand warbled voices. Now it's dense and dark, probed by snipe, the slink of water rail, quartered by barn owls, and the float of red kites. A stiffening wind, a cold rain, the day is already slipping. And in the river, aside from the trout and salmon that draw anglers from around the world, are those species a little more coarse. Bite comes, but this is no roach. A jag, a head shake. Spiked dorsal slicing through the mirrored veil. It's a fine perch, and the light tackle is tested, as is my nerve. Final bristle, bronze glowing in the gloaming. Stripes and spikes at day's end. Mm.